After four days of sick leave, Ukrainian President Viktor Yanukovych returned to his desk on Monday. But in Independence Square, very little had changed, with anti-government protesters still occupying the area. One of the president's first tasks will be to seek an end to more than two months of street protests, some escalating into violent clashes with riot police. But activists remain skeptical. I think it makes no difference whether Yanukovych is back or not, said this protester. The process is moving forward, and now it just doesn't matter. We're not expecting much from him, only negative things, nothing useful. It's hard to say what kind of people will come into power when this all ends, said another protester. But whoever it is, after this Maidan protest movement, they'll think in advance about their actions. People will not forget it. On Monday, opposition activist Dmitry Bulatov arrived in Lithuania, where he'll receive medical treatment after reportedly being tortured by unknown assailants. Meanwhile, Alexander Daniluk, activist and leader of the anti-government group Spilna Sprava, has reportedly arrived in London, apparently fleeing imminent arrest.